Hi Cubbies, we're back for another lesson. And today I have my assistant, Faith, here to help me turn all our slides. Hi. All right. Well, Cubbies, I don't know if you remember last time we talked about things that started with the letter A. Today we're gonna to talk about something that starts with a different letter. Do you know what letter this is right here? What letter is that, Faith? C. We're gonna start talk about something special that starts with the letter C, and it's something from the Bible. Now remember, the Bible is God's special book, and God talks to us in the Bible. So listen to what I read and tell me if you hear the word that starts with C. So Romans 5, 8 says, well, we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Cubbies, did you hear the word that starts with a C? Did you hear it, Faith? What is it? Yeah, it's Christ. It's Christ. That's our word that starts with a C. So Christ is another name for God's son, Jesus. We sometimes call him Christ or even Jesus Christ. Faith, can you flip our slide? Good job. Okay, God sent Jesus Christ to live on earth. He showed love to everyone, including the children. How do you think Jesus showed love to children? What do you think? I think that he showed love to children by telling them stories in the Bible. Yeah, and he, remember he tells his disciples, let the children come to me. Jesus cared about the children and he wanted, wanted to have the children with him and listen to them. So let's say our cubby's motto, Jesus loves me. Can you say it together with me? Jesus loves me. Great job, cubbies. All right, Faith, let's look to our next one. Now, Jesus showed his love in a big way when he died for us on the cross. It was hard for him to die on the cross. It hurt him a lot, but he did it because he loves us so very much. Cubbies, let's say Romans 5 8 together. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Let's say it one more time. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Good job. So Cubbies, do any of you know why Jesus had to die? Jesus died because of our sin. Because Jesus Christ, he never, ever sinned. But remember what we learned last week? All of us have sinned. Do you remember what sin is? Sin is anything we think or say or do that disobeys God. And we're all sinners. We all make mistakes. And God said that sin must be punished in a big way. The word punished means getting in trouble for the wrong things you've done. So at home you might get in trouble when you don't do what your mom or dad tells you to do. Or um, if you fight with one of your sisters or brothers. But God says our sin gets us in very serious trouble. The punishment for sin is death. But we don't have to worry because God loved us, so he sent his son, Jesus Christ, to be punished instead of us. Jesus Christ died to save us from being punished for our sin. Can you flip our slide there, Faith? But guess what? Jesus didn't stay dead. Stay dead. On the third day, so how much is three? Three fingers. On the third day, Jesus Christ came alive again. And then he went back up to heaven to be with his father, God. Okay, can you flip this verse one more time, Faith? And here's the best part, Cubbies. All of us can go to heaven someday and live with Jesus forever. But how do we get to heaven? Do we fly in a rocket ship? No. Or maybe grow wings like an eagle and fly up? I don't think so. Mm -hmm. What do we need to do to go to heaven? We need to trust Jesus as our Savior. That means each of us must believe that Jesus Christ died to save us from our sins. We believe that, that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. So Cubbies, we've heard a lot about Jesus today. So what questions do you have about what you've heard? Maybe you can um, tell me some of your questions or your parents can put them in the, in the comments. Those are all good questions. You could talk to your parents about those. Like I said, you can have them put them in the comments and we can um, answer back to you whatever you wanna do. Now, one more flip here, Faith. Remember, A is for all. All have sinned. That's what Romans 3.23 said. And there's our A. And now let's go back to the very first one we had today. I'll get this faith. And C is for Christ. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. 
Well, that's our lesson for today, Cubbies. Thanks for joining me. Faith, thanks for being my helper. You're welcome. And we'll see you guys next week. Bye. Bye.